Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm sharing my 26 week pregnancy update. And things got real this week. This is the first week that I've had in a while where like I had a lot of new symptoms. Also, disregard my appearance. We are still moving. I've been running around like crazy. And I really can't find any of my clothes. So first for the baby at 26 weeks, um, your baby's two pounds now. That's the weight of a liter of Coke which is pretty heavy. This thing kills me. You're two thirds of the way through your pregnancy and your uterus is about two and a half inches above your belly button. I'm two thirds of the way down with this pregnancy and I'm still so unprepared. <laughs> I'm getting the stress sweats or just the sweat sweats because it's like 100 degrees outside. This week I feel like she had a really big growth spurt because her movements aren't just like kicking and jabbing anymore. I'm starting to feel more rolling. You can start to see it like slowly come out of, there's crumbs on my stomach, ignore that. Um, but I'm starting to see her movement like out of my stomach and it's just like rolls. She actually woke me up yesterday with this like terrifyingly aggressive roll. Do not quote me on this, I have an ultrasound in a few days so I guess I'll know then. But I feel like she might have flipped, I don't, I don't know. The movements are in different spots now. I'm feeling a lot more on my the sides of my stomach and somewhat up here. So fingers crossed that she's flipped. I don't know for sure if your sound coming up um, June 1st, I think. So very soon. So like I said, we've been moving all week and um, I've just been go, go, go for probably the past month doing way too much than I should be, I feel like. But it's gotta get done. I put together a garage sale this weekend of a ton of crap that we didn't need. And I walked up and down our basement stairs probably a hundred times. Maybe more, honestly, I'm not really sure. But I was sitting at my garage sale and I noticed that my ankles were somewhat swollen and my hands, um, I like could not get my rings on. So yeah, I had a little bit of swelling this week. My hands feel a little swollen right now, but my ankles, look good. After my weekend though, my hands and my legs and my ankles were so sore from everything that I was doing. So I had Shane massage my legs and feet for so long and it was dreamy. I'm definitely still crampy when I don't drink enough water, but once again, I've just been on the move so much that sometimes I forget, but like my lower back gets really crampy and it shoots down into my legs, but I've been seriously trying to keep that at bay because it's miserable. My belly button is so sore, but not like inside my belly button, like the part that I had pierced a hundred years ago. Um, it's so sore and it just feels like raw almost and I can tell it's stretching a lot. Who knows what this is going to look like after this baby, but it's my own fault. Really red the last few days, so I don't know, again, with I feel like she had a growth spurt because this week my belly button has been so sore and I've just been rubbing so much cream and lotion on it. <sighs> my peeing has gotten out of control. I think I got up six times to pee last night. Six times. I pee all the time. And I had a little day date this weekend and we went and got stuff for the house that we needed and um, random things. And it was really nice, but it was an hour and a half drive and I was seriously dying. I drank iced coffee on the way there and I had water. Mistake. <laughs> I have never had to pee so bad. I was waddling into Ikea. I would have pushed people out of my way to get to that bathroom. It was terrible. Frequent bathroom trips is another reason why I think she might have flipped because I'm feeling a lot more pressure down there. Um, it's a lot harder for me to get out of bed this week. I grunt and roll. <laughs> Shane's probably like, oh my goodness, Marissa, get it together. but. Um, yeah, it's just, you know, I just have to flop myself out of bed and hope for the best. I did get a pregnancy pillow this week and it has been a game changer. I love it so much. I want to take it with me everywhere I go. It is amazing. So you guys do not have a pregnancy pillow. I will link the one that I have down below. It's actually really affordable and so unbelievably comfy. I think that's pretty much all my symptoms. I've just been really emotional this week really really emotional my hormones have just been pretty crazy this week um but we'll get there my cravings are still pretty much the same but i have been craving shaved ice like 
Hopefully I'll get one this week because I think about them all the time. Other cravings are the same. Hot dogs, I still want them constantly. Uh, watermelon, everything else, it's all the same. Very happy. I'm happy to be in my new house. We have tons and tons of work to do and we're still working on moving out of our other house, but just really happy and grateful and <sighs> we're getting there. Oh, also, I forgot. Lucy felt her baby sister move for the first time the other night. We were laying in bed and um, she was moving like crazy and Shane had felt her and she was going crazy. And so Shane was like, Lucy, put your hand here. And she put her hand on my stomach and <laughs> baby girl moved right away. And her face, Lucy's face was just the stinking cutest thing I've ever seen. She like, couldn't believe it. She was like, oh my gosh, cool. She's gonna be the best big sister ever. She still doesn't have a name. Probably gonna update you guys every single week telling you that she does not have a name because yeah, we just, uh, we don't know. <laughs> I think that's all I have to update you guys on though. Um, I didn't weigh myself this week. I'll find out on my next doctor's appointment and tell you guys where the weight's at. I just don't care though, which is crazy because I cared so much in my first pregnancy and it's not that I don't want to be healthy because I am trying to be a healthy human being. At the same time, I'm like, you gain weight when you have a baby, so we'll deal with it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you in my next video. Bye! Here she is, getting so big, it's crazy. There's something sticking out of me right here. I don't know what it is, but yeah, she's growing.